Hello everybody. Uh, hope you're having a good day. I'm coming into Canton, Texas. I'm on Interstate 20 East uh, towards Shreveport, Shreveport, <laughs> Shreveport, Louisiana. See right there that brown sign? It says First Monday Park, next four exits. And so what we're going to do is I'm going to show you the sign up here. And uh, I get off at the second exit. The first exit is Highway 64 that takes you into downtown Canton. You take it to the east. I get off at Farm Road FM 859. And what you'll see when you're coming into Canton, there's a travel trailer sales right there. This guy over here sells bulldozers and all kinds of stuff truck trailer sales, cargo trailer, horse trailer sales. Uh, it's all kind of stuff in Canton that you can come down here and buy. Uh, this is year round. Uh, they're not, you know, they don't have a booth in Canton. <laughs> but uh, you can see everything up here on the left. You would turn to the right and stay to the right and go to downtown Canton. You can also go to the Civic Center. Uh, over here to the left is Duke's. Uh, it has a taco restaurant in it, gas. It's a pretty big place. It's not as big as Bucky's. It's about a quarter as big as Bucky's. I'll get a picture of it for you here. See it right there? And then we're gonna come up here to my exit that I get off. And the reason I get off here, it takes me to the main entrance of Canton Park on the city side. There's there's several sides of Canton. The city of Canton owns what they call the city side, the city side, and that's who I rent my space from. And then the other side of that is the Lewis side, which is a privately owned uh, place where he rents his spaces out to anybody who wants to rent them. And then you have the mountain, and you have Dogtown. That's where the animals are. Uh, you have the mountain, which is, it's not really a mountain, it's just on a pretty good size hill. Uh, also down here in Canton, they have some really good water. It's probably some of the best water I've ever had, right out of the faucet. And they have a water place right outside of town that was left to the city as long as they didn't charge people for the spring water. And I can tell you, that water tastes good. Uh, they don't add anything to it either. It just it's good tasting water, but they have that. And the city of Canton has some really good restaurants. Uh, some of my favorites are if you're on Highway 19, which is the main street, uh, Highway 64 and Highway 19 intersect with each other. So if you're on Highway 9 or Highway 64 and you run into 19, if you took a right, you would go up to the the memorial, Veterans Memorial, which is incredible. They have a Coast Guard boat, a jet, uh, they have a helicopter. But you turn left and go down about a mile and on your left is a Chinese restaurant. It's really, really good. Across the street from that is Walmart. They have Applebee's. But if you go back up that same street and go in front of Walmart, take a ride at Walmart, go up to the left is a place that's called, uh, I believe it's called Beans and Burgers. But at that place, you get an all-you-can-eat salad with any meal you buy. And I don't know that that's changed. But the food there is excellent. Now I'm getting off here at exit 526. You can see right there that swim part. And you see there it says exit 527 for Applebee's, which is uh, Highway 19. Uh, that takes you to the Dairy Palace and all kind of indoor places that people buy and sell things now here's a sign that says first monday park and i'm going to go up here to uh edgewood is a town it's not a street <laughs> i'm going to take a right and you'll see that sign right there uh, to the left is the hospital over there and i'm going to take a right and go about a mile uh, well, actually two miles. Uh, that's a new apartment complex they just built over there to the right. Uh, 
uh, just about all of Canton is farmland or ranch land. Uh, there's not many people that live here. I think there's about maybe 2,000 people that live here regularly. Uh, the rest of the time, when First Monday's here, there's about 50,000 people. <laughs> it's huge. People come from all over the United States. I've seen people from other countries here. Uh, they just come from everywhere. But uh, this is the same road also that you can run up to the Sheriff's Department, bail bondsman. There's a cabinet shop right there, Canton Industrial Park. Uh, that place right there, I think they moved right over there. They make all those mixes you see in the store where you just add water for uh, like three bean soup and uh, beef stew, stuff like that. There's the Catholic Church there to the right. They have a catfish fry on Friday nights, I think. You might check with them. Uh, right here is a uh, wholesale business. Uh, where they, Now we're gonna turn into the First Monday Gate, which is right here, see, First Monday. You're going under the arch, and it says, Westgate First Monday Trade Days. They say five miles an hour, they mean five miles an hour. Uh, when you first come in here, if you're not a vendor, uh, you go up to this little cabin up here and you pay them five bucks and they show you where to park. After you park, uh, you can walk to the road in a tram, which is a tractor pulling a trailer made for people to sit in, will pull you down to where I'm gonna take you. See, there's a little building right there, and you park right in there. Right down there is the RV park, and right over there is an RV park. And this building down here on the right is referred to as a log cabin. And uh, if you wanna be a vendor at Canton First Monday, now it's always the weekend before the first Monday of a month. So it's not gonna be after the first money, it's always before. So there's what they call the log cabin right there. That's the restroom, that's where the tram lets people off. And uh, we're gonna go through here and I'll catch up with y'all later. Well, he didn't make me stop, so I'll just hang with you. Uh, this is usually full of, of RVs right here. Especially in the summertime, it's packed. Um, we're gonna take a right right here. Right there is known as the uh, uh, Pavilion 6000. There's all kind of stuff in there and it stretches from the city of Canton over to the Lewis side. Now we're gonna pull in here. There's some vendors setting up. And uh, a lot of vendors hadn't made it here yet. They'll be in here all day today. Pretty cold, it's 41 degrees. Uh, a lot of people here, there's this travel trailer. You, If you're a vendor here, you, when you rent a spot from the city, there's electricity and water within 100 feet of your spot and you're allowed to spend the night on it. So people actually come down here and they camp for the whole week and they don't leave until the following Monday. There's some vendors, there's people always in the way. You gotta watch out for people. Uh, they'll walk right out in front of you, it's crazy. And here's a vendor setting up, and if somebody's got it, you can rent tents down here. Uh, you can rent tables, you know, you can rent all kind of stuff. So, uh, these are spots that people rent and do different things. Anyway, I'll talk to you later.